taking bets. Whoever loses has to buy everyone by Chloe for lunch today. We have our state support here in this document and all the information from there. And then he was like, well, I'm asking because I have a surprise date planned for us. Alright, so we've been working for just a little bit and I think Jenna and I decided we're going to go to Target because Jenna's favorite coffee creamer. It's so good. And it's only, we can only find it at Target and like nowhere in the city sells it. Yeah, nowhere in Manhattan. Like you have to go to like the Bronx or like Brooklyn. I emailed them and they haven't answered me. <laughs> she emailed. <laughs> I'm like, can you please She emailed Manhattan? Silk and was like, help. So Jenna and I are going to go over to Brooklyn and we're going to go to Target to get coffee creamer because I put my almond milk and then I put my iced coffee and I only put literally like a teaspoon of the creamer but it makes... Whose shoe is that? Oh my, my shoe. <laughs> Wait. Wow. Hey, should we stock up? She has no Yeah, oh, can you get sweet so and creamy? Long. Sweet and creamy? I don't like that one. Give me your orders. Sweet and creamy, and we'll pick. Well, I'll tell you my favorites in order. Hazelnut, vanilla, caramel, pumpkin spice, sweet and creamy. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go. Alright, so you leaving? Yeah, we are heading out. Give me your time estimate. How long is this gonna take you, please? I think we'll probably be back in like 30, 40 minutes. Complete false. Complete false. What do you think? Like 30, 40? Three hours. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's gonna take, this is gonna take you two and a half hours total. No. I say like two hours and ten minutes is my guess. I'm thinking like 45 to an hour at the most. You're like Justin Timberlake with math. With time. I'm like me with math. <laughs> like what? <laughs> Alright. Well, so, two and a half hours. We're taking bets. Whoever loses has to buy everyone by Chloe for lunch today. Is that open? <laughs> it, it's open. Well, I'm not eating by Chloe. I lose this anyway. I'm not gonna eat that shit. <laughs> Start the clock. Somewhere. No, we'll start the clock when we get on the train. Start no, the clock. No. Let's start what? The clock out the door. That's the whole point. You got to start, yeah. like at the starting so, point. What if I needed to stop so, and get something to drink? It, well, that's part of your. <laughs> no. It's if you not. didn't leave the apartment, you wouldn't be going to get something to drink anyway. So you're that is included in your trip time. Well, I can't buy my subway card, and let's just figure this out in a second. Wait, I gotta figure something else out. Look up. What's this black thing on your face? Let's really get close. Wait, I Let's find my subway card. I have mine. I have one, but I don't think it has any money on it. I have mine. Okay. Wait, you can't find yours? It should be in your wallet. Um, oh, it's in my backpack. I saw it earlier. I remember now. I found it. All right, countdown timer as soon as the door shuts. Right here. I'm gonna make Jenna, right. like, run. All right, you ready? This is what's happening. Go. Go. Sprint. <laughs> run. Bye. Mm, bye. I, but wait, can we go to Starbucks? <laughs> Not a red, no, okay, actually, yeah, because, I mean, you're going to be wrong anyway. I guess two hours and ten minutes. So. <sighs> so basically, I'm buying everyone's lunch today because I'm, I just believe in myself that much that we can get it done in 45 minutes. Hey, this Glossier perfume works really well. I'm wearing mine too. The gel? Just put it on. Coffee creamer before. I see the coffee creamer. It's literally. It's there? Well, no, I see like the like, red. Oh, I out. thought you saw it. Hope they have it. Okay, they don't have it. Oh my god. <laughs> Should we walk to the other Target? No, it's really not that far. It's like 10 minutes. Ugh. And the other Target had a bunch? Yeah, when I was there, they had it. We should go. So Jenna just called the other Target and they don't have it. So now we're calling Stop and Shop. Stop and Shop to see if they have it. Mm, high demand coffee creamer. We found it. We found it. 
original. <laughs> Those aren't flavors of the one I'm talking about. They ha it's like hazelnut, vanilla, sweet and creamy, pumpkin spice, caramel. Silk, yeah. Are you positive? Okay, thank you. See you soon. Here's the stop and shop that Jenna was just on the phone with. So, fingers crossed. Found it. Get one for my apartment. Two, I want um, hazelnut and vanilla. Wait, <laughs> oh my gosh. This is the best day. Hug him, kiss him. <laughs> So weird. Okay. No. Like okay, we're at target number two because, okay, so we didn't get the stuff that we needed at target number one because we were gonna come to target number two, but then we found the coffee creamer and then didn't get our stuff from target number one. Yeah, because we didn't want to carry it. So yeah. Stop and shop. So now we're here at target number two. I'm gonna head back. I feel like since the first target, didn't have the coffee creamer, we, that shouldn't count. Cause that's what we came for. We're waiting for our Uber. Because I got a plant stand and we would not make it on the subway. Would I'm not standing like that. <laughs> what are you thinking about? No. <laughs> Today's been a weird day for you anyways. Oh my God. things did you knock off the shelf today? Just rough guesstimate. Five. Two candles. Vacuum. <laughs> the dog bones. Dog bones. <laughs> so, two hours, Ryan. 48 minutes. No, we had to take a detour. Oh, that is that's the fair way. No. Well, it doesn't matter if you had to take detours because that just happens. That's a part of an outing. So then what? Now what then? Well, now that I'm just right. That's that's the whole key. I said two and a half. You are 18 minutes over my guess. So you have to buy everyone lunch. False. <laughs> See you later. We have our statement of work here in this document and all the information from there. Obviously paired up with the photo debate and over as well. And this is that. So I see the key ads, so that's the project management. So that is when you are paired up with your project manager, as I mentioned, they will be your point of contact. Okay, the samples for two rounds? It'll be, yes, yeah, so we'll make the initial sample after the first round. So, okay, we're going to attempt to repot Ty because he's like so jolly nice. green giant <laughs> um, so we bought this for him at Target um, so we're gonna try to re-dirt him or repot repot re him this is Ty's situation right now like he's falling over he needs this pot so okay oh god he's so big uh, he's like, Mom! Oh my god, he's like, Mom! <laughs> <laughs> it's like one of those things like that are like, <laughs> like that. <laughs> like outside of the car wash. He's <laughs> like, I'm like almost embarrassed at myself. Alright. Is that enough dirt? I think so. I don't know. I might have to go get more. So, why do you love dirt? Oh, it smells like dirt. The hard part getting them out. Like chunks look like chocolate chips. <laughs> Don't mean it. <laughs> mm. Oh my god, that is so dangerous. I feel like I'm cutting organs. <gasps> you hold the pot and I'll pull. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at his gut. Oh my god, fell on one of this. We would need so many band aids. We need a shovel. I need more Ow. dirt. <laughs> Here. Ah. Ah. Okay, ready? Wait. How much room does he have over here? Um, There's a dirt store. 
Okay. I think... Oh, cactus. Ryan, I thought that said spaghetti. <laughs> Should we get this? This kind. Um, In case I need dirt for my non-cactuses. Yeah. I don't Wait. Know. No, that should work, right? Good morning. It is Sunday morning. And so, no one wants to hear what Blue has to say right now. Hold on. Just give me a sec. We are going not me and blue ryan and i actually meet oh i need to start over whoa it is sunday morning and i just put my makeup on i'm about to fix my my hair and i'm gonna go run some errands today i was on um h and site and i saw some pretty cute stuff and i'm gonna go check it out in the store and kind of see what they've got going on i need to return some actually i need to exchange something at zara and we'll just see where the day takes us, but that's what's going on right now. I just like applied all my makeup, got my lipstick on, and then I was like, oh, actually, I'm pretty hungry. So I went and ate, and I'm gonna have to like, brush my teeth all over again, go fix my hair, brush my teeth, get an outfit on, because this is what we're doing right now. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. I got all the way down the street before I realized that I forgot the camera, so I came back up and got it. And... I am wearing this top from ASOS. It's fun, it's like black and navy. My faux leather black shorts from Zara. These shoes that I got on Poshmark. I thought they were pretty fun. This bag, yeah, that's what we're wearing. Okay, I'm gonna go now. And you're gonna go now. We're both going together. I just met the nicest guy in my elevator. So many people because when I'm in the elevator with people, they always talk to them and like, I don't know, I'm just interested. But he was one of the founders of Rockaware. So cool. because I need a folding chair and online they're like $70. So I'm like, Target will definitely have one for like 10 because that's reasonable. So we're on the hunt. We're on the hunt for a folding chair. Let the hunt begin. Score. Show it off. See how fancy it is. Demonstrate. Set it up. Set it up. How do you how do you work one of those? Let me show you. Whoa! I almost didn't make it. <laughs> now do like a, a J Lo dance on the chair. She's not paying for our chair. All right, Ryan's looking for a to go coffee cup for our morning walks. I like that one. That's probably my favorite. This one? Yeah. yeah it works. I don't know. Ryan, good. Jeez. You're supposed to do that. Oh, you don't flick it. You okay. Don't do that. Okay. All right. Bye, bye, basket. See you in a few. See you in a few seconds.
Okay, I have a quick outfit change. <laughs> now I'm wearing white tank green jacket from Free People. Same leather shorts and my Fila sneakers. I'm not going to tell you where we're going yet, but um, I'll tell you when we get downstairs outside. Something we've never done before and I'm really excited. We also got these from Target. The last conference we were at, we heard the guy, the founder, who created this speak. Um, and I heard really good things about it. And they had cucumber and mint and coconut vanilla. All the other scents were sold out, so we got these two. Here we have finished product. Signed. It's very professional. Yeah. So this is hers. Uh, let's go take a look. <laughs> this is mine. <laughs> she looks evil. No. Looks to the Gary world. Let's see Gary and Sarah's now. Yeah. Sarah did an audible. She's like, I'm gonna throw a Santa hat on it. And then she messed up on the mouth. She's like, I'm gonna put an ornament in his mouth. <laughs> very well done. Very, very well done. This one. Oh, that looks yeah. really damn good. He looks like a very distinguished He gentleman. does. Yeah. He looks like he's headed out to taste whiskeys like or a guy later with tonight. A shirt on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they recommend this place, right? Yeah, it's so fun. Muse painting. We should find our girl. She's so cute. Okay, that was so much fun. We got our paintings. Ryan? This is beautiful Stella. <laughs> I love the lady. Um, yeah, that was so much fun. And um, the place was called Muse. Muse painting. And it is in Tribeca. And everyone who worked there was so nice. And it was like overall an amazing experience. So, um, totally. It was super cold. We'll definitely be back. If you're in the city looking for something to do with friends or whatever, do that. It's fun. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was a, a lot of fun. There was people that weren't even painting their own pets, too. Yeah, some girl was... painting some random things. <laughs> some girl was painting a giraffe. But it was, like, <laughs> really good. Way better than ours. Yeah. She's a talented giraffe painter. Okay, we're going to walk home. I don't want to make you guys dizzy while I'm walking.
No. You go this way, I go this way. <laughs> well, the time has come. The time has come. And we're gonna go to bed. But we'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow's Monday. We normally don't vlog on Monday, but anyways. We're gonna go to bed, but we will see you guys. On a new makeup area, did ya? Well, this is a temporary setup right now. Amazon, I ordered a little cart and it's gonna keep all my makeup in it. It's like a little cart. It's like this big and it rolls. So I'm gonna keep it in my closet and when I need to do my makeup, I just roll it out. It's a very nifty idea, miss. I know, because then I can be close to the bathroom and I don't have to go in the other room. I like your ingenuity. I'm, try I'm testing out this foundation right now. Don't look at my makeup thing, it's so messy. Because I moved it and everything fell. But I've been trying out this makeup and um, I like it. What's it mix called? It. It's the Too Faced Peach Perfect. Mix it with my Derma Blend Smooth Liquid Camo. Derm. Derm. What are you getting ready for, miss? I have a meeting today. So I thought that I would share with you guys some of my my meeting routine. Meeting tips. <laughs> meeting tips. Business routine. cash meeting tips. Ash tip. Hashtag. Yeah, so this is a super casual, well, it's not super casual. It's with a um a producer, like a TV producer of a certain channel. It's like a fun, it's not like a serious, it's not CNN. <laughs> but I do have a little nighttime routine that I do before a meeting. So for example, last night I put some face tan on my face so I would have a little bit of color to my face. And then I also did a hair mask and then I woke up early and rinsed it out and I'll link the hair mask below. It's really good. It's my new favorite. So I always give my nails a fresh coat of paint. Um, you know, you don't have to constantly, you know, spend a lot of money on a manicure and pedicure, but, you know, you can definitely, like, do it yourself and just give yourself a fresh coat. So, I always make sure my nails are good. I do always like to grab a coffee before a meeting, just so I'm not, like, wah, wah, wah. Because when I wake up in the morning and I don't have coffee, I'm literally a slug, like an actual slug. I always like to keep my makeup a little light, so I want to do neutrals, maybe nudes, um, if you're not like a nude person, maybe like grays, I think grays are a good neutral as well, yeah. Don't want to do bright eyeshadows, like I love my pink shadow, I've been using my blush as my shadow lately, and I think it's so cool and I love doing it, but I don't necessarily think I would do it for a meeting, um, but I will stick with my, my beiges and my neutrals. Um, because again, you don't want your makeup to be distracting in the meeting. The same kind of goes for your lip. You know, don't do like a bold, bright red lip or like a super dark lip. Um, you want to stick to kind of nudes, mauve colors, kind of like earth tony colors. Earth tony. I'm making up words now. Also kind of goes the same for like an interview as well. You're meeting somebody for the first time and you potential, potentially are going to work with them again. You know, in, in the second meeting, I of meeting the same person, I might, um, 
you know, be a little bit more crazy with my prints on my outfits or maybe do a fun eyeshadow. But, you know, the first time meeting somebody, you do want to make a good impression and you don't want your makeup or your outfit to be super distracting. You want to be able to show like who you are and what you can offer. I'm going to do a winged eyeliner. And since I am doing a winged eyeliner, I'm not going to do mascara on the bottom lashes. I'm just going to keep it on the top lashes. I forgot to contour. What the heck? I would have walked in there with dark circle. You know why I forgot to put concealer under my eyes? Mm -hmm. Because when I have tanning stuff on my face, my dark circles aren't as noticeable. Do you guys notice that too? Born with dark circles, I think. <laughs> I came out and my mom was like, oh my God, she didn't get enough sleep in there. <laughs> she has little baby dark circles. Sleep in there. I have to turn the camera off now because I have to do my eyeliner and I have to get like up close to the mirror. But I'm gonna finish up my makeup and I will see you guys when it is time for hair and Ready. I kept my hair pretty simple, just parted down the middle like usual with some waves. I basically I curled my hair and then I went over with the straightener so it would turn more into like a wave than an actual curl. Then for my outfit, I'm wearing this blazer top, um, nice and printed, some good colors from Topshop. I'm wearing these redone denim crop jeans. You know, since I am super busy on the top of this um, blazer top, I decided to just keep it super simple on the bottom. This is like a sit down meeting, so no one's even really gonna be seeing my bottom, just my top. So I wanna make sure to make a statement on the top without being too crazy. Um, simple jewelry, just my um, vintage necklace and then my rose necklace. So yeah, this is what we're doing. I would normally carry just like a regular purse, but I am taking the subway and like a backpack is just easier when I'm on the go. Um, but I think it's cute. I think it adds like, I don't know, I just feel like this backpack kind of goes with everything. So this is what I'm wearing. Oh, and quick little tip, perfume. You don't, this is not really so much like a meeting tip, just kind of like a life tip. You don't want to overdo it on the perfume um, because, you know, sometimes people are get headaches triggered by perfume. So you want to keep your perfume light. Um, all the time. You never want to overdo it because I know sometimes you're like, oh, but I can't smell it on me. Other people can smell it on you. So um, don't overdo it. But yeah, I am going to head out. I'll see you guys when I get back. And I kept saying, like, I don't know. I just have to see how the day goes. I don't know. And then he was like, well, I'm asking because I have a surprise date planned for us. Ryan. Hey. <laughs> how cute. He planned a surprise date. He's taking me to dinner to this French vegan place that I don't, I, he won't tell me where. He always does this. I don't know where we're going. But what's the occasion? Are you just, like, what's going on? And he told me that he thinks we need to go on a date have date night once a week and so we are naming Wednesdays as our date night I'm probably just gonna wear this because it's super comfy these jeans are really comfy I'm gonna finish up actually I'm gonna go edit finish up edits on this vlog but I'll see you guys in just a little bit so one of these has $30 on it and the other ones have zero this has zero 
one of these. NYC Metro Probs. It'd be so much easier if you could just get a refillable. Oh, you oh, can. It does exist. That does exist. We should. Why haven't we done it? Because we're freaking lazy, dude. We're in the West Village. The village of the West. Western Village. Such a nice area. This place is hopping Look at right all here. this. So many hopping places. 